Good morning. Uh, this is Hiro Matsuda. Uh, we're going to be working on another project. Uh, those of you that have been following me on uh, my videos will probably recognize as being the remnants of the multiple air layering. So from here, we need to actually restyle. And I'm thinking, we'll call this chapter Restyling a um, Juniper. And one of the things that I'm considering is this line is okay, but what if it stood up? So I'll go through this process and think it through, and then I'll show you um, the final solution. I think this could be a very dynamic uh, juniper versus right now it looks like just a worm that's crawling along the ground. Ooh, the worm crawling on the ground style. Okay, before getting started, I'll give you um, another look to see what we have to work with. It's okay tree. I'll give you a close-up look of what we have to work with. Okay, the first thing you gotta do is find out uh, the elements of the plant. Meaning, like on this one, I wanted to stand it up, but I wasn't sure how the roots were. Well, the roots are fine. Uh, they're very fine. Okay, now see how the dynamic changes as I work this? Now, the question is, what do I put this in? Okay, now I got it in as a trial fit. I'm not 100% sure that this is going to be the way it is, but um, I have it secure, so we'll proceed as being the solution angle. The thing that drew, drew me to this particular tree was this branch coming down like here. So um, I'm thinking this whole top will go. Done. And now, I think it flows much better. Is this the finished product? No, no, no. We're working on our main line. Okay, keeping with my philosophy of not wiring unless absolutely necessary, I just use the string to pull it down. A whole lot safer. Uh, it will not damage um, when you forget to uh, take the wire. Okay, so this concludes this chapter on restyling a uh, juniper. This is the Procumbens nana or uh, dwarf Japanese garden juniper. Um, you could see from the beginning that it was more horizontal. Now I got it more upright or at least a slant style with a different apex. If you enjoy this chapter, please keep checking my website masteryo.com and I'll be making more of these uh, hopefully interesting project for you. So this is Hiro Matsuda saying goodbye and I'll see you real soon.